Jake. So. Just, just one Jake. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I don't see how it would benefit you in a fight. Uh, yeah. Other than the – even the, the feeling of the pain, I don't think that it would – Well, I could just imagine myself doing that. And, it, you know, after first round, go to sit down in the corner and be like, I don't really want to get up. Yeah. <laughs> Can I have more of that water? <laughs> like I would have such cotton mouth inside of there. Right? With the mouthpiece, your, your tongue's stuck <laughs> they, they to go the top to, of they, it. They go to pull the mouthpiece out <laughs> at the end of the round. It's like, that's not Drum. coming Your out tongue's or. coming out with it. <laughs> <laughs> it's not coming out. Desert mouth. Yeah, I mean, do you smoke, Jessica? I don't smoke. I mean, I have in my life. I don't. Um, but it's so funny. I was talking to somebody the other day, and, you know, people are affected differently, especially by different strains and whatnot. So I don't know if they're what, what like, sativa and uh, Indica. what's the other one? Indica. Yeah. Isn't there one that's supposed to give you more energy or something? I mean, one head, one body, right? I, I think, yeah. One, one is, a, is a awake, one puts you to sleep. That's mm-hmm. the kind I like. Um, because and that's why I initially started smoking was because my back um, at night I just couldn't find a I mean sciatica Same. yeah right. I mean you couldn't find a comfortable position and you couldn't even fall asleep and then I started smoking and it was like oh like you can relax. totally relaxed um, had no problem falling asleep anymore uh, mm-hmm. I still take a little bit of sleep aid with it too but but uh, but yeah I mean it's done miracles for me as far as the pain and the with sleeping. Have you seen the video? Um, it, someone posted just today or yesterday or last night. Um, it's the, a guy that has severe Parkinson's. Really? Yes. Like yeah. Severe, severe. And he takes one hit off that thing. And it was like five minutes later. Mellows he's him out. up. He's he's speaking Aww. clearly. Like, and he didn't have to use his cane. And the first thing was like, "Do you have any candy in here?" <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> he's instant munchies. He's like, "You're hungry." And he's like, yeah. He's like, I can talk. And he's like, Aww. you know, starts like barely singing and stuff. It, it was, and the, and the reason I I ask about all that stuff is like my my grandfather before he passed, he had severe Parkinson's as well, but it was so painful. I remember his arm, and you guys can't see this, but his arm was so cocked in a weird way, and he was in so much pain that they had to put a brace in so that he wouldn't uh, just contracted break. muscles. Yeah, yeah, it yeah. wouldn't break his own arm. Um, and he would never be the person that would smoke anything. Very conservative, Texas. Uh, well, you know that's all. It's all put. It's all taboo because of what Big Pharma has has put on it. Oh, the government has put on it. Started yeah, on this is pharma. this is this is a, a a plant that has healing abilities and that, grows naturally. Yeah, and grows naturally. And 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 you. I mean, really, you don't even have to fuck with it a whole lot. I mean, there's guys that do the hydro and all that stuff and make it a little more potent. And now they're doing the dab dab oh, thing. Dabs. Yeah, oh, dabs. Yeah, like Jesus. I have no it's desire weird. to do that. Yeah. I watch here. Let me put a video up of me taking one hit and then passing out and shitting myself. <laughs> nah, probably not where I want to be at this point in my life but thanks anyway but <laughs> dirty Sanchez, right, right. That, that's a <laughs> somebody would that's do a it shooting too. the shit Look at the people right, there. Hang around. right. <laughs> but the walls are covered but he really was shooting the double barrel doo doo <laughs> right. but that's but that's exactly what it is i mean it's it, they're gonna lose so much money on pharmaceuticals that they've tabooed yes. this this drug mm-hmm. and and or yes. this plant and, and and i mean Hemp, come on, man! You could stop c- cutting down trees. Hemp grows inside of three months. That would, equ- you know, equ- is the equivalent to you cutting can make down a house out of hemp. Dude. It's insane the things they can. I do. made a skirt once. We're, we're- <laughs> no, I didn't. I'm just kidding. <laughs> that time I was on naked and afraid. <laughs> <laughs> and I just Tyrion Lannister. <laughs> fuck shoes. I need a skirt. Is that a hemp plant? What the? Fu- That's a fucking hemp plant. I am good. <laughs> those, those shows, dude. I, we watch those all the time, and we've been watching them a lot more lately. But these people are running around making themselves skirts and and Bras bikini and shit. tops and yeah. shit, and then running bare th- barefoot through a fire ant fucking parade or whatever. <laughs> that genius. I like the yeah. pain. Don't 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 make yourself a pair of shoes or anything. You know. <laughs> Well, choose. A little cock sock on there. And <laughs> well, what is this stuff called? It. Um, it's it's not a gel. It's almost like a lotion. Uh, Stiliva? Yeah, the salve. So people Sav, are yeah. drinking yeah. off with yeah. marijuana now? <laughs> 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 Your dick is never going to get hard, dude. 
<laughs> you just know, you novocaine the, the shit out of that motherfucker. But it's happy. <laughs> My dick has the munchies, but not for tacos. <laughs> <laughs> you can play helicopter all day long with that bitch. <laughs> No, but like for, for my, not, not all day. For my, L, two, for my L4. Two twirls. It's too, too tired it after too that. Tired. I got no motivation. Yeah, so, since my knee surgeries, they blocked one nerve on one leg, and they screwed up my L4. Plus, I have um, my discs are um, squished. What do you say? Compressed. Compressed. Or... Thank you. I said it earlier. And then, anyway, so it shoots. <laughs> I like squished better. Yeah, right? I think squished should be a medical term. It right. should. But it goes all the way down into my feet, and my feet hurt really, really, really bad. Do you so, have restless leg syndrome? Um, not really. No. no. You, um, do, every you find, now, do you find yourself fidgeting down there because trying to find a spot where the nerve isn't pinched or da 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 da? The only, if I'm sitting down. That's, that's actually a term, by the way, da 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 da. Yeah, I know. And squish. See, and squish. So, no, what will happen is that's why I always sit on the edge of the um, chairs, is because if I go all the way back in the chair, then my right thigh from my lower back all the way into my knee starts shooting pains and goes numb. So, anyway, so I've been rubbing that stuff on it. Plus on my feet, and then I'll wake up the next morning, and it like the pain is gone. So what? What? Up. What is the lotion? What is it? It's a salve. It's made. It's made from uh, marijuana, and it's. Okay. I mean, it's got. It's. It's got. It doesn't give you the high like right. like it's it would if you were to smoke it or sometimes mm-hmm. do the edibles. Mm-hmm. But it, 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 it's. It you still get the same benefits as far as pain relief goes. And yeah, like Jessica, my Jessica uses uh, it for. She's got interstitial cystitis, um, which is. A very painful bladder syndrome. It's it's ridiculous. Not a form of squishiness. It's, it's horrible. But she has been rubbing the salve on her belly lately when she gets seriously, you know, a lot of pain, and it, it helps her a little bit. I mean, she she notices a difference. Yeah. So I put it on my elbow for my, you know, tendonitis, tendonitis and stuff yeah. like that, and it helps take the edge off or whatever. But yeah, so I'm all I, for I just, it. <clears throat> Go ahead. I don't think I can ever smoke anything. I just, it's always been a syndrome in my head. Like I just can't bring myself to do that. Is it because it, you because you think you're doing drugs? No, it's just I I just I I can't do it. Grew up with my parents smoking and, and all that stuff, and it just grosses me out in every way. So the so edibles a, are okay. You're good with edibles. Well, it, it depends on who's giving them to me <laughs> nowadays. And the instructions yeah, I've uh, received. A good a good friend of I, of ours. Um, <laughs> he uh, <laughs> that I may or may not be related to. <laughs> Uh, he he uh, started me on something way m- more than I could have ever should have. Been. So in other words, you should have just licked the gummy bear. <laughs> no, there was no gummy bear. It was a, a it cookie. Was, it, it was a, a cookie. A bag of cookies. Well, that's the problem. Oh, you Jesus, don't you give Drew anything that looks like a cookie don't and expect it. him to be you reserved. <laughs> <laughs> Where's my milk? <laughs> but uh, no. So and then the other thing that bothers me is the smell. Like. It pisses me off. I mean, you, you see my rock crawler, and um, I drive it during the summer almost all the time. But you go – I mean, you hit Fillmore or you hit a certain place on Academy. Plaque, and it just anywhere on yeah, I mean, it just slams into your face. And I'm like, oh. Like, I get to the point sometimes where I'm gagging because it's so, like – I love potent. the smell. I love the smell. Yeah, I don't it. like the smell. You don't either? Mm-hmm. I mean, I don't, I don't know. whatever do what you do. I mean, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm a proponent for it, absolutely, especially if it's for pain or something like that. But, yeah, I don't like the smell. It has so many different benefits. I mean, depression, all kinds of yeah, stuff. That's true. It's 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 crazy the things that that if you actually got into someone who did some valid research and look up what they've discovered and and the actual effects on the human body. Uh, my girlfriend's cousin Amber. She is Doesn't like everybody have a cousin named Amber. I, I, probably, <laughs> I think everyone should. But Amber is like super intelligent, does a lot of research, and she can go on and on and on about the benefits of of medical marijuana. Mm-hmm. And it's crazy. I mean, you don't you don't even realize. I'm I mean, gonna be super controversial here. Yeah, I would prefer like if a doctor were to want to put one of my children on a pharmaceutical. And, and marijuana would help them. I would fucking give my kids marijuana before I'd give them a fucking pharmaceutical. Absolutely, they, that's what they wanted to do to me. They wanted to fuse my spine and put me on morphine, and I was oh, like, "Hell nah. no!" Well, you, I know and so you've already people. lived that road, dude. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So many people have. Oh my god! I mean, their lives have been wrecked by. I watched my mom go through a, a morphine addiction. Thank my God, mom too. she's completely yeah. off of it now. Yeah, but. it's it's scary. It's 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 horrible. I mean, and again, I don't smoke pot. I don't do not advocate my children smoking pot. In fact, I do take the very conservative road verbally with them when it comes to marijuana. 
But at the end of the day, I mean, if it's something that's going to help one of my kids get out of pain or help with ADD or I, I mean, I'm not saying it helps with ADD. I'm just I'm throwing out. It does, by the way. It does. OK. <laughs> so then I, I would fucking here. Here, baby. <laughs> Mama giving you a cookie yeah. before I'm going to fucking give him fucking like. What's that shit? Ritalin or yeah. the fucking rat Adderall. poison shit? Adderall. Oh dear Jesus! Oh my God! People who are addicted to Adderall. Well, and then I mean, the side effects of all of those, you have oh, to take yeah. another drug for that, to fix and that, it's just and then it exactly. going. one giant cycle. You know exactly. what I mean? But yeah, absolutely. And I and I think it's you know when it comes to the actual recreational side of things, it's still better than alcohol. It's yep. still better than any other drug, basically that you can put in your body. That's you know made by man. And and I think as long as you're responsible with it, I, no, I I wouldn't want my kids doing it until they were grown adults Absolutely. and could make a decision on their yeah. own and, and be responsible with it as well. Um, but but that's just it's the same as with booze. I mean, you have to be yeah. a certain age because that's when you're responsible with it. And well, and, and they're not even responsible. Then and you either. can see the guys like driving and stuff like that. I don't know how anybody does it. I I have zero desire to, to drive while I'm high. It, no way. Well, and that pisses me off too. I mean, because. That's an equal amount of, of driving drunk. Well, you know you can get a DUI um, or, for driving yeah, you can. under the influence of marijuana. And I, th- I think it's a little different. I mean, like when I've driven drunk, you know, I hate, I hate to say that, but I have. I've, when I was younger, when I was 21, I, I got a couple of DUIs. I was just an idiot. I was out, out at the bars all the time. I, there was nothing smart about me when I was 21. But I, I mean, I, there was times when I was like, shit, I can't see. But mm-hmm. you're still – in the in your head, you're like, oh, I got this. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? I fucking cover one eye, the right. whole the whole pirate patch driving home thing. Yeah. But with pot, it's 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 a different kind. I think it's your your reaction time is going to be slower. Yeah. Yes. You're not gonna. You have absolutely zero desire to 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 like drive 100 miles an hour. You don't <laughs> you don't feel invincible. You just feel you know hey, I'll get there when I get there. You're going 20 and a 65. Right. <laughs> but 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 that's but that's dangerous too. You know, and that's where it becomes dangerous is that you're not. Completely completely paying attention and you know what I mean? I mean, there's been times where I've been like, Oh, I don't have pants on. (laughs) Did not realize that. Have you seen the, the, are you wearing pants now? (laughs) Maybe. I'm not. They're called skin pants. (laughs) (laughs) I thought we were doing the queef thing. So I took my pants off. (laughs) Don't let him influence you. (laughs) I've been good lately. So, um, yeah, Dave Chappelle, man, he came out with a new Netflix special. Um, and I don't know if you like Dave Chappelle. I love, I love Dave him. Chappelle. I love he is Dave the Chappelle. funniest son of a bitch. But he was talking about just that, that they got pulled over. Um, he had a designated driver, and the DD was obviously high too. And they got <laughs> Because pulled. that's all they do. They, right. Those guys are high every moment they're awake. Right, but they're on the 405, and they get they get pulled over, and you know the cop out he, he reaches in and he goes, that's Dave Chappelle. Hey, Dave Chappelle. And he was like, what's up? No, no, no. You know, just doing this whole thing. <laughs> anyway, he pulls the driver out, right? And next thing he knows, because he's like, oh, man. He's like, I'm turning up the radio. He said, anytime you can turn up the radio when you get stopped by a police, you know you're pretty good. I mean, this you're going to be good to go. And the next thing you know, he saw his friend getting handcuffed and put in the squad car. And he's panicking. He's like, what the hell am I going to do now? Because, you know, I'm not drunk, but I'm high as hell. And the cop comes back and says, I tell you what, if you pass the breathalyzer, you know, we'll give you the keys and you can go. Otherwise, we got to impound the car. And uh, he, he he's like panicking, so he gets he does the breathalyzer, he passes it, and can't believe like how the hell he passed it. What are they testing him for? <clears throat> you, can, I don't think you can, can test you, for. Um, I was going to say, I don't right. think you can test. The but he couldn't over. believe it, so he was so happy because he got to get in the car and he starts driving. <clears throat> he said it took him like three hours to get home <laughs> because he was going thirty on the four hundred five. <laughs> I was like. That's exactly how it is. At least be. he was being careful. I mean, <laughs> I'm in the slow lane with my hazards on. <laughs> you know. So I I really would like to know, kind of circle back around to as far as why they're deeming marijuana a uh, performance enhancing. That's drug. the problem. Nobody fucking Nobody knows. knows. No one knows. There is no answer. I, I I haven't. I mean, I, I haven't even actually done research on I it. I mean, Maybe protein I'll do shakes that. are pro- performance enhancing. Are drug. they? No. I'm just <laughs> saying, if we're really going to go that route, let's just go fucking all out. You can't eat chicken no more. It's right. A, a giving giving your muscle drug. too much protein. Yeah. In in the fight game, things have changed so much that you can't even have like this specific bottle. You cannot even have that on a sanctioned MMA fight because Why? it has labels on it. Um, you have to have a non-label bottle. No colored no, drinks. No colored anything um, because they're worried that you're, you know, you're throwing in 
Um, um, some... Something that's going to help you along the way. Whether even if it's an en- energy drink, you're not allowed to have an energy drink before. You can't have an energy drink. No. no. What? So, and if they piss test you in Colorado um, with MMA fights, I don't think I've ever been piss test before a fight. Um, and I don't know about you, but no. I mean, Mason, he would always say, he would be like, okay, you know, randomly we can, you know, test you anytime we want to. Never got tested. Um, not that I ever needed it, but like if you were to drink a, a monster energy, whether it be high levels of whatever's in there. 